Hello, my wonderful friends. Meg is here on a beautiful day. Welcome back to the library. Today, I want to talk about a book that means so much to me. It's Caraval by Stephanie Garber. And I'll tell you why it's, it's precious to me. One, it's just a beautiful read. You guys know how much I loved Night Circus. It's one of my top five books. And the beauty of this is the circus. You live in it. You can smell the caramel corn. You're a part of it. This book does exactly the same thing. And I mean, right from the beginning, when the sisters leave the island and and they come to this town and the clock shop and the magic, you are there. You can picture it. And it's so exciting. And this book, it is exciting you know night circus i love so much uh but but it's a lot of character development and, and romance and this is just action and so it, it's night circus with action and another reason this is a part of my life that when i walk by the shelves and i look at it it puts a smile in my heart it's because i shared it with my daughter and then her stepsister. I think of her as a daughter, too. Uh, and it's something we all read together at the same time. And it's so beautiful. And, and then it's a story uh, about sisters and family and just such a strong bond. You, you know, they grow up in a household with an overbearing father. And and so when, when they get off their island, I mean, that's an adventure in itself. Julian, uh, he's a sailor, and he gets him off the island and takes him to care of all. And it's just, it's like they're, they're getting away to something better and they dreamed about it. And so it's like a dream coming true and it's magic. I love any books about magic and it's, it's beautiful. You know, I don't know how much I can tell you without spoiling it other than to tell you if you did like Night Circus, you will love this. And then Stephanie Garber too, I have to say that what impressed me about her is I follow her on social media and I reached out to her to share my story of what this book meant to me and with my daughter and her stepsister and she contacted me back. How beautiful is that? Who does that? What a beautiful soul. What a beautiful book. Now, now there's three books in this series. My daughter and uh, her, her sister finished all three of them. I, I I didn't want to. I probably will one day, but I love this book so much. I just wanted to live there, you know, and just hold on to that, hold on to that memory. And, you know, part of me was worried, like, what if it's not as good as this? And they assure me that, that the books that follow are great, that I would love them. And so I'll probably have to get into them uh, one day. So, so I just wanted to share that with you guys. And another thing, if, if I can just tell you something from a guy that's 53 years old, that books have been friends that have brought me so much love and joy. You know, I have books on the shelves that my mom read to me. So when I walk by that, can you imagine how that makes me feel? I, I have the books that I read to my kids. I have books that I read out uh, on the boats, uh, on the ocean, when we would have some downtime, just sitting out there rocking and the sun reading. I look at them and it brings me back to that. Books are so amazing. My friends, they're like photo albums of my life. And, and so I was, uh, I'm always trying to get you guys. Like yesterday, we hiked up. I keep a chair up on the top of the mountain. And I hike up there and read. And the birds are singing. And the sun is shining. And it makes these memories. So now when I see those books I read up there, I'm going to remember those days. You know, make it special. And speaking of special, I, what I want to do today uh, and I'll probably, so I'll, if this works out, I'll have a, another video coming out tonight though, but I really want to do a manga run. So you guys know I live out here in the woods. It takes me about an hour to get to my local bookstore, but I, I, I want to do a manga, uh, book shopping and, and haul and bring it back. Uh, but what I struggle with is, uh, and do you guys deal with this? I love book shopping. But I also love just being at home with a warm beverage, reading my favorite books. And so it's hard for me sometimes to get out. Once I get out, I'm happy. I'm glad I did it. And I come home, put them on my shelves, and I'm excited. Uh, but it's just that initial. I just have to, like, 
just get in the car and start driving and just get there. And then I'm glad I did it. But so I'm hoping to have that video for you guys later tonight. So anyway, Caraval, if you do read it, please let me know. And if there's any other books like this, because I obviously love this theme, like circuses and carnivals and magic and just that 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 atmosphere that it builds you, you know, uh, let, let me know if there's another book like that that you've come across and love. All right, guys, I love you so much. We'll see you later tonight.